Previously on Starship Rebellion, the ORC Echo Base was destroyed, but Kronos managed to commandeer several unmanned antimatter tanks to save the survivors. The party set up for Moltown to extract intel and destroy the Operations Center in order to gain an advantage against the ESA. On the way there, the party members shared their backstories about how the ESA ruined their lives and destroyed their homes, giving them something in common to bond over. Okay, time to explore Moltown. Uh, are the enemy trucks not going to stop us? Weird. I think we would at least need something to camouflage to make ourselves look just as red as they are. The air, it hurts my lungs. The smog is so thick, I can't even see the sun. They said that a lot of the ESA planets have environmental issues. The city is the center of industry and relic processing on Infernus. As a result, the air and water are quite polluted. Although indoor areas typically have high quality recycled air. Let's find the casino and be done with this place. Am I- don't tell me there's a poison effect we're walking around. Huh. Giant mechs as well. Can we pilot them? Buildings with no doors. What the- Somehow I, I picked up a piece of food on the ground? No, these are from rats. I see. By hunting- I'm basically hunting rats for meat. That's a- kind of a funny mechanic. Do they spawn infinitely? That's the real question. Get out of my face, I can't stand AI. What? But I don't think any of my characters have AI-generated faces. Do they? Medica. Injury and death can occur through a myriad of factors. Harm can be prevented with the proper medical supplies. So that's a medical robot, huh? Good thing I've got a setup that allows me to generate resources infinitely. I should consider my options. So Jumper Barry is Synth Revive, okay. Got all those hard to find parts for any number of projects. You'll find it all right here at Cellmax. Yeah, wait, can I use these parts to make armor for my robot? The terrain of Inferno is going to be quite unforgiving. You need to make sure you're prepared and geared for survival. Literally the same kind of armor from, uh, from the Rebel shops. Streets of the Moltown can be a dangerous place. You need protection, okay. Matcon Scythe, okay, but what about... I want stuff for T-17. T-17 is super weak. Pay is good. It keeps the food on the table. Why the hell am I talking to you? Somebody's gotta enforce the rules around here. It might as well be me. Moltown. Prime Robotics. Oh, this might be... Uh, maybe I can get my stuff here. Credit tree? What the heck are you about? Instant credit, available now. Don't do it, Chronos 13. These short-term credit loans typically charge an astronomical amount of interest. We don't want Bionic Hunters coming after us. Got a total sausage fest here. The classics and some exotic choices. What can I help you with? Muscle Bullschlong. What? Everything here is pretty much an euphemism, huh? Soy balls. That's what... Everson was eating in prison. What are the best memories available for your consumption? A lifelong love, a fr lifelong friendship, trauma, or pain. We have it all. Memory. The sign said we would win big, but that didn't happen. Tripodian. A robot with, uh, or no, or, 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 uh, an organic species with exactly three legs. I'm going to get back on my feet when they take a 90% cut. I might as well not work at all. I haven't been able to find good work. I definitely don't want to be one of the enforcers. Trying to stay warm. This planet is so cold. Maybe not for the terrace, but for a truck scene, we prefer temperatures above 350 degrees Kelvin. I'm freezing, I'm freezing my ass off here. Oh, this is kind of reminding me of Volward from Dystopia. Once this Zelenov array comes online, clearing out the scum in the outer room will be a piece of cake. Where are you looking at, Android? Get lost. Are they not going to recognize that Cronus 13 is one of their own androids? Don't do anything stupid, you'll regret it. Prime Robotics, there must be a way to upgrade my robots here, come on. A lot of these guys look just like... T-17. Oh, yes, finally! Okay, but I might have to farm some money, because damn, this is kind of expensive. Selling a rebel uniform would be a dead giveaway, wouldn't it? So far, I only bought the... Mod that resists electricity in order to eliminate or reduce the weaknesses. Yes. Okay, fully upgraded T17 as far as I could. 
Hopefully this, these stats will be enough. 306 defense is pretty good, but the power defense issue is still going to be there. It's... Hmm. Yeah, let's see. 135 is the lowest power defense of the whole party. That is not going to be good. I may want to start investing in those defensive passives to deal with that. Okay, before heading to the casino, what's in the north of town? Anything interesting here? Any more shops? Sister 19 Lounge. Okay. I have a soft spot for cent uh, Centauri Woman. The way they move is so majestic. There's rats in here too. You're on a business trip, checking out what Infernus has to offer. We're making some repairs to the door at the moment. You have, you'll have to go around. Casino bodyguard. Wait, what? Oh shoot, that means Zerk created Sister 19 by merging AI an old style pleasure bot with a business management suite. This place is quite formulaic, but who can argue with the results? Get out of the way, Android. You're interfering with my dance moves. Tomatillion. Oh yeah, shake that bulbous body. Show me where that pumpkin spice comes from. Come on, pussycat, hiss for me. 25 hiss. Wherever your kink is, you'll find it here. Acrobatic input analysis, 42.8% complete. Some people are into some seriously freaky shit. I prefer the classic, a traditional Terran woman. The rats have become a real problem in the last m m few months. They're everywhere. I'll pay 250 for every dead rat you bring me. Wait, what? It looks like you have 22 dead rats in your possession. I'll take them out of your hands for 5,500. We like to sell your rats. There's no downside to this deal, is there? They seem to spawn infinitely, so why not? But still, that is a good way to make some money off of them since they're not very good healing items anyway. I overheard you speaking to Grognard about the rats. I can get you in touch with a breeder. You'll make a lot more credits that way. Wait, what? A breeder? You mean for the rats? Yeah, what else would I be talking about? I didn't even... This is a part of a side quest? What's the point in Grognard paying us to get rid of rats if are just breeding more? Look, I know you're trying to see Zerk. Charging 100,000 credits for an appointment is highway robbery. Think of me as Robin Hood. I'm just giving the credits back to the people. Bring me the rats instead. For every rat bringing age, I'll give you free rats just that are just past their prime. Grognard won't know the difference. You'll make more credits, and I'll be able to greatly expand my operations. Come back to me when you cost some rats. What is this entire operation? They have no, more than enough credits to house all of us, yet they let us ride in this ghetto. I used to have it all, but I couldn't do it anymore. Bring an enforcer sucks life right out of you. I've worked hard all my life. What do I have to show for it? Absolutely nothing. They'll chew you up and spit you out. There's no escape. Crystalline man. A Geodonian as well? Or are they different? Get lost, android. No one authorized personnel may enter the administrative district. Let's check out the bank real quick. The BOA offers credit exchange services over 30, over free financial institutions. Serving clients on over 750 worlds. Feel free to use any terminal. Is there a purpose to this place? The credits were there last night. What happened? They won't make the transfer. What gives? Yeah, something is fishy here. Okay. It looks like you have 27 rats. We like to trade for 21 old rats. Yes. One day, my rats will rule a sea. Pleasure doing business with you. You're the reason why there's endless rats, huh? So, will you actually be fooled? The rats have become a real problem. Okay. Looks like you have A1 rats. I'll take those off your hands for 20k. Yes. He doesn't even know the difference, does he? But I'm still far from being able to afford the 100k fee. But the rats did respawn. Damn, they're breeding way faster than I expected. I saw it would at least take a few days. I think it's best to farm the rats inside the dance hall because there are a lot fewer view-obstructing obstacles around to make it uh, uh, for the rats to hide behind. 
Well, man, we might as well just check out the casino from the front entrance. Maybe there's a money-making gimmick in there I can use. I don't know. Uh, zero. Game isn't free. You have to bet something. Yeah, I'm guessing that betting is gonna be, like, completely rigged in this game, so that if I try to bet high, they'll screw me over. I don't know. Or maybe uh, the house always wins. 100. You lost 100 credits. The house doesn't always win, but you lost big time. What's even the rule here? What? What? Which one do I want to hit is the real question. 25. Wait. That's terrible. What if I say 1? They don't even multiply my credits? You gain zero credits, a partial win. Wait, what? No, it gives you like a- it's a percentage-based thing, I see. But I sort of sank if I lost again. We all know Casino's just a front. Why hasn't Zerk been arrested yet? All the games are rigged. That being said, Black is going to be your best chance. Really, no. Hmm, that, that. All AIs try to cheat eventually. We're watching you, Android. So I said we win big. When's that gonna happen? Never. Huzzah, not gone. Wait, I didn't want to go that far yet. What happened? We're here to see Zerk. It's urgent. Do you have an appointment? Appointment? We've never needed an appointment before. Times are tough. Zerk is a busy man. If we make an appointment now, how long will it take? Anywhere from six to eight weeks. Weeks? We don't have that kind of time. There is one way we can move you to the front of the line. How? Zerk will meet with potential clients without an appointment for a price. If you pay a few of 100k, you can make meet with him today. 100 credits? 100k credits? We don't have that kind of money. That's your problem. Not mine. Maybe try to look at the casino, or find rats. You might win big. That's a scam. I don't like those odds. Hmm, maybe there's another way. They want you to save in case you blow all your money. Wow. That's kind of proof that this whole place is a scam. Anyways, let's talk to everyone here. There's not, there's not a lot to do on Inferno. This place really takes the edge off. I think losing my bros after a long, hard week. A circular gambling here. The machines are rigged. They're t t yeah, I don't think it's possible to win even with the blackjack, is it? They kicked me out of the lounge. They said the way I used my technicals was too freaky. What a bunch of prudes. I want my money back. Wait. The lounge is now open. I guess I have to... I guess it's so to avoid breaking the cutscene. That's why they had that guy at the door. Well, the Alliance is, Alliance is going to have a harder time than they think. Shutting down all unauthorized trade is going to create shortages. They have delusions of grandeur. Great croak, I've lost again. Wait, you're the... You're the PP. What? I won the first time, but I was just beginner's luck. That's how they hooked me. I can't stop. Why did I even ever play a stupid game? I can't stop. Oh, no. The only reason for a sinful come to the casino is to cheat. Move along. Circular of Jubilee. This drug can make you feel like you're winning, even when you're losing big. The only AI I want to talk to is one that can help me beat the odds. Just one more spin. I could win this bit of time. I don't think so. It's rigged. There's no way I should have lost this much. Just one more spin. Ugh. Not again. Yeah, let's avoid... Back to hunting rats or just beating up enemies outside. What about you? What are you all about? Kongi... Konki Donger. No cheating. Konki Donger Shong. The dong will crush you. <laughs> oh, man. This session is beautiful. It's so ornate. That means there's a trick to it, maybe. Ornate? Are you saying that there's some kind of way to use... Maybe there's some kind of secret passage in it? Anyways, let's go kill some rats. 35 rats. 105. We can ha carry that many, huh? Okay, let's trade them in.
Okay, now I have over 100k. I can go talk to the, uh, the casino owner. I wonder if you, if you do this quest, if you continue doing the whole rat thing, you could st actually still get to. Uh, uh, you could also use it to buy equipment, huh? Yeah, so use it to buy all your max out gear. Do you have the 100k? Yes. Why guard 50 dessert? We have some visitors. They paid the fee. You're not gonna attack me, are you? Understood. Zerg will see you now. Um... I'm calling in my favor, Zerk. Who's interrupting me during my meditation? Crux, is that you? Is that what you, you call meditation? You may leave me now, ladies. What a pig. <laughs> Don't compare me to that disgusting earth creature. I'm a man of refined taste. What do you want? We need you to help us with some IDs. What sort of IDs? We need to sneak in the city's operations center. You've got to be kidding. I'm afraid not. What do you plan to do? Know your business. It is my business. The casino isn't enough for me to survive on. I want the Alliance gone just as much as your little terrorist cell. Terrorist cell? We need to access the command center's relic database. Or people are dying out there. Can you get us the IDs or not, Zerk? You're going to need more than IDs. That particular database is heavily encrypted. Normally, it wouldn't be a problem. But... But what? My associate, Relnor, he fabricates my IDs. He's also the only one I know who can help you with your encryption problem. Unfortunately, he's in a coma. What? How? He was in the middle of an operation when we lost all contact. He's lost. In cyberspace. Oh no, I have to go into cyberspace then. Maybe he's still alive. Maybe we can find him. I'm guessing now you have a terminal implant. They don't come cheap. You do have that android though. That could work. If you can find Ralnor and complete the operation, all of us can win. What's the operation? It might be risky. What do you need us to do, Zerk? Zerk Enterprises has a very diverse business portfolio. Unfortunately, some of our business divisions have run to some inconvenient laws and regulations. Where are you getting at, Zerk? Some of our accounts were recently frozen by the uh, Bank of the Alliance. Ralnor was transferring the funds when he lost all contact. I want those credits returned to me. I want you to find Ralnor and complete the operation. Bank of Alliance, account number... Whoa. I don't... Someone write that down. Someone... Uh, bank account number... Ugh, that's a big number. Someone write... Uh, I hope the Android can memorize it. Some is over 43 million credits. What you're suggesting we do is a serious crime. If we get caught, they'll put us away for life. It's a risk, but if you want those IDs, wouldn't this be easily traceable with so many credits being transferred at once? Salami slicing? Take this credit laundering algorithm. It'll transfer credits as small transactions across millions of accounts. It'll be virtually untraceable. Salami slicing, so to speak. Okay, Zerx, we'll do it. Excellent. I'll be waiting for the funds to hit my account. Until then, I have important business to attend to. I'm a very busy man. Ladies, let's get back to work. Come on, let's rob a bank. Let's find this bank of the Alliance and get this over with. Use any terminal, huh? Whoa! What's the trick here? This interface. It's different. Are there any countermeasures? I'm detecting multiple automated defense protocols. If we go combine, recombine our efforts, we have a 26.2% increased probability of success. We must find the one designated as Relnor. Wait. Oh crap, do I have to fight here? Molarian Intelligence, how strong is this guy? Damn it, he has some skills, but I don't know if it'll be enough. Wait, no! Oh no, he's weakened! No, he's... They're both weak! 
They're both so weak now. This is compl a completely different system. They're like completely different characters. Okay, there's some items, but I should probably avoid fighting if possible. Then again, fighting might be the only way to get knowledge. I don't know. Oh no, some of them cannot be avoided. All I can do is attack. Okay. Zeron's pretty strong. Sort of. But I don't have a way to maintain charge between fights, do I? They're all slightly faster than me, too. Do I get knowledge points at all for winning? A little bit, but not enough. Not enough to do any immediate upgrades. Seriously, what are these things? What, the small ones don't seem to do anything at all. I see Ralnor going that way, but what's up here? Activation nodes 1 of 3. Start activation node. I assume I have to activate all of them, right? Yeah. Probably have to activate all of them to progress. So I was, it was actually wise to not immediately go to the right. Over a trillion credits? What could they possibly be doing with that kind of money? I have to check this out. That was awkward. Ah! Two different kinds of corrupted data. No, stop getting up on me. I'm just a little guy. Okay, got more healing. Activate two out of three nodes. Okay. Do these enemies respawn? That's the real question. Yes, they do. Intercell Supply Corporation. That's Director Kearns Company. They've never had any contracts here before. What are they doing on Infernus? Okay, that's all free. A trillion credits for one mining operation. Whatever they're looking for, it must be big. Okay, did I repair? Access denied? Wait, but I did all... Why? Why is it denied? I did everything. There must be another... Something up ahead that I need to deal with first. The last firewall. Finally, some answers. That was weird. Help! 
Please. I've been trapped here for days. My body must be falling apart. What happened to you? A Malarian? I thought all of you were extinct. Xerxes sent us to find you. We need your services. Glad to help. Assuming you can get me out of this place alive. How do you end up in this situation? I came only to make a simple tra credit transfer to Zerk's account, but then I found something else. Something I couldn't let go of. A one trillion credit transfer was made to the Interstellar Supply Corporation, all for the excavation of one relic. The inhibitor, no contract that large has ever been awarded for a single relic excavation. The ISC has never done business on Inferus before. Chief Director Kern is chairman of their board. This goes straight to the top. Kern. Oh right. You're extinct. You must really be out of the loop. He's the head of the state of the Earth Systems Alliance. Since the occupation, they brought nothing but trouble. The Advena. Advena? What? In any case, if Kern is involved, then it must be big. I was deactivating the last firewall and I became trapped here. The controls are elsewhere. The terminal just behind me was a trap. I'll unlock the remote terminal from here, but it must be activated at the source. Find the other terminal. It must be the one from the south. Get me out of here. Activation notes 303. Deactivate firewall, yes. Firewall deactivated. Okay. Now get in my party. With the three of us together, we can overcome whatever boss is here. Thank you. And ahead is the final terminal. Finally, some answers. Yeah, he is in my party. Virtual avatar, but he... Does he have any skills? No. He only has the most basic default skills. Dang it. At least give him like a thousand knowledge to start off with. Transferring credits to Zerk's account. Now, to get a look at that other account. Here it is. The crowd truck is for a dig in Virago Valley. Not That's not far from Mole Town. Are you able to access information on what's being excavated? One moment. Damn. Big program. Level 9 threat detected. Quarantine protocol activated. Oh no. It's gonna be an unusual boss fight. The heck does data lock do? Does it actually work on you? Okay, temporarily stops time for you. That's a lot of damage. Okay, regular attacks don't seem to do too much. Oh, buy me some slight amount of time. Lost data lock. Healing.
Just normal text spam, because that's really all the options are giving me. No more data lock. Ow. One more blow. He off. Data repair algorithm. Sticking your nose in a place that doesn't, where it doesn't belong. Kern himself. Don't tell me I have to fight you too. Shit. It's really him. A Molarian? We're not gonna expect a surprise. Advena. You mean this guy went back to the past to attack you? Ronor, get us out of here immediately! I wonder if I, we have to fight this guy in cyberspace again later on. What if he transferred himself into Chronos 13's head and then takes over at the worst possible time? Chronos 13, are you there? Did it work? We found Ronor. The transfer was a success. We? Zeron. He was there too. Someone who was able to interact with the virtual environment. Oh man, I hope that guy did not get into- uh, uh, did not j download himself into Cronus 13. That would be such a, a big betrayal. So we're gonna go. No. It might end up with, with Cronus 13 sacrificing himself to get rid of Kern's data or something. We have a bigger problem. We encountered Kern. What? You mean that Kern? There was another account. A trillion s credit transfer. A dig in Virago Valley. Whatever, whatever's out there, it's big. We can talk about this in a more private setting. We don't want to draw further attention to ourselves. We've been at this bank terminal long enough. Let's get back to the Zerks. Affirmative. Circle C now. Okay. Excellent. I got my credits back. Where's Relnor? I'm afraid he didn't make it. What do you mean he didn't make it? There was too much neurological damage. He didn't reintegrate. What? Then we're shit out of luck. I didn't say that. Some of Relnor remains. What do you mean, some of him? We were able to save his avatar. His memories were preserved. We'll need a suitable host to make the transfer. I'll take his avatar. Dude, how many people are you putting in your brain? I don't know, guys. Chronos 13 already has one guest swelling around there. I can't handle two. Chronos 13 has plenty of memory capacity. Enough for several more of these avatars. You're gonna keep saying that until we have literally every avatar in a planet and we'll, we won't have any more room. We'll have to start deleting uh, old files. However, do doing so increases the chances of unpredictable behavior from the android. That's what I was afraid of. I need to know what Kern didn't want us to find the, the Virago Valley. Information on the dig must be stored in the command center's database. What Kern is an avatar in there as well? <laughs> you encountered Kern? I did not want to attract that kind of attention. What if he finds out I helped your little terrorist group? I'd be ruined. Maybe you shouldn't have been off more than you could chew, little piggy. The fact remains that we need those IDs and Ronor's description skills. And we're going to have a chance at accessing the database. With the operations center out of the way, it'll take them time to regroup. Then we make a mad dash to wherever this Malarian relic is in the Virago Valley. Our people are dying out there. I don't think we have a lot of good options. Hopefully this isn't a wild goose chase. They activate the android. We'll be getting a transfer. After this, our business is concluded. Our doing business with you all has become far too risky, even for me. For a record, I hope you succeed. Their cut is way too high. It makes it hard to run an honest business. Yeah, sure. Honest business. Chronos 13, go to sleep mode now. We'll wake you up when we re reintegrate your neural net. Affirmative. Initializing sleep mode. Oh man, you guys better not put Kern in there. That would be bad news. Well, that means he might show up for... Uh, 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 Ronor will be an ally in Earth's cyberspace battles. Where am I? The last thing I remember is escaping from Kern. Yeah, we can't even... His physical body is too damaged, huh? You didn't make it in time. Your body is dead. They were able to preserve your avatar. 
What? I'm really dead. No. I offered to host your avatar. I think this place is... me? And I guess... it's their own as well? It must be inside your neural net. I guess that means I'm stuck with you. What's happening right now? My systems are undergoing a diagnostic startup routine. They must have completed the transfer. I'm waking up. Transfer is successful. Chronos routine is coming back online. Diagnostic self-check. Processing. Processing. Prime robotics, huh? Are you sure we didn't screw it up? No. But let's give Chronos routine a minute. All systems nominal. I told you all we had nothing to worry about. Chronos routine. Do you have Relner's memories? Accessing. Affirmative. We need to get into Moltown's operations center. Can you get us inside? One moment. May I access the controls? Yes, of course. Applying template. Fabricating clearance level. Trans transposing physical appearance. Modifying DNA signature. Our IDs have been created. We've taken on the identity of a mainframe maintenance crew. We'll be able to enter a facility. However, we have a 64.8% chance of being discovered before we complete the operation. Where'd you come up with that number? In that case, we'll just have to fire our way through. Time is of the essence. Let's get moving. Did our reputation change again? Yeah, we lost the reputation of the ESA because Kern saw us. Okay, surprisingly, ba blackjack is not a bad way to earn credit since you you can uh, you can bet five digits, which is actually kind of insane. And of course, you can save scum to avoid losing all your money. So even if I lost this one, I would just reload. Okay, nineteen. I should hold here. Watch the dealer get like a total. Uh, draw. Uh, pick a ten next. Okay, that's still pretty bad for me. Ugh. But yeah, I can just reload and try again until I make it big. This might actually be more efficient than grinding out in the wild, since you can earn quite a bit at once. Even if your chances of winning are probably like 50-50-ish. It's not like the game knows you're using your save file to cheat. Of course, he's probably gonna start cheating once I bet really high, huh? Yeah. Oh my goodness, look at this! I actually got Blackjack right from the first two cards. So if I pick 11... Player total 21. Instant win! Blackjack, yeah! Of course, the trick is they're supposed to let you earn big in the beginning before they betray you. Yeah, so with this I can actually start affording more stuff. Okay, this I do all the money I saved up. I managed to put positron a temporal accelerator on everyone. It lowers their max power, but also increases their agility a lot. Hmm, that should give me a good speed advantage against the enemy. Yes. Problem is my skills also become a lot less spammable. However, I feel- it seems like a lot of skills just scale to your max MP anyways, I mean, or max power, so I don't think the power hit really matters too much. Yeah, 121 power. That's about a third of what he has right now. But if I were to take this off... It now costs 166 power, which is still about a third-ish. So it seems that... It doesn't actually... Max power does not actually matter in this game. Compared to just... It, uh, uh, to, to just having a lot of good base stats. That's what I feel like anyways. Since your skill costs are always going to scale to it anyways. 
So in a way, the penalty actually does not matter at all. Having extra speed and two actions per turn just makes our team insanely strong. Okay, check this out. I actually gave T17 resistance to electric by getting a second triple grand circuit. Yes, these will stack. That will help a lot in trying to res resist anything it's weak to. Yes. With this setup, I should be pretty much good to go in terms of uh, in terms of non-cyber battles. And non-tactics battles. Yes. Your IDs, please. You're here to repair a faulty mainframe. Affirmative. If there are seven of you, then it must be pretty serious. It seems like a question why there's a giant combat robot behind us. My diagnostic panel is showing the mainframe to be in perfect working order. I need to check with my supervisor. Wait. That's the problem. The diagnostic sensor is out of whack. It will show as working even if there's a serious problem. Your supervisor will be unaware of the issue. We received a work order only a few minutes ago. I'm sorry, but I'll still need to check in with my supervisor for approval. One moment. Trank him. Employee 117 of Supervisor 21. There's a maintenance crew here to fix something with the mainframe. My readout is showing there's no problem, though. Uh-oh. Hmm. Okay. Understood. It's a trap. You may proceed. But before you begin work, the management would like to have a word of you. They want the invoice number, who requested the work, and they need to confirm your credentials. Report to the management on floor 18. Uh... That was close. What do we do? Certainly, we can't go to floor 18. It will be discovered immediately when they double-check our credentials. Credence 13. What floor is the mainframe located on? Floor B7. I say we go straight to floor B7. This isn't going to be easy. Are we sure we want to do this? The only way we're going to have a chance is if we get that information. I'm not so worried about getting us getting in there, but how are we going to get out? We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Come on. Let's go. Clearance level insufficient. Okay. You say there's something wrong with the mainframe. It looks okay to me. Maybe you're the one to the error. I've got a lot of work to do. I don't care much for Androids and AI in general. I'd rather do the work myself. Your 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 face looks kind of AI generated though. The irony. You're in my way, Android. Can you go somewhere else? The noise is distracting. Lockdown effect. Wait, what? I just came from there, dude. I better grab some items first. Charge and power station. Where are you? are you a healing bot? Medical supplies. It's been a while since I saw one of you. Damn. Okay, more healing items. Tactical implant. So I can put multiple implants for some of you. Mainframe core. I see, they all lead to the same room. So, that's so confusing. Hey, hurry, Kronos, I'm sure we figure out we didn't go to port floor 18. Affirmative. Oh no, do I have to go with cyber again? I do. If I'm in cyber, I'm not going to uh, be in hard mode. I'm on normal mode only because my uh, customization options are limited. Where are we? We're inside the Multan Operations Center mainframe. Really? In my past life, I would have killed to gain access to this kind of information. We don't have much time. Let's get any, any relevant data we can. Yeah. I'm pretty sure the cyber world is only balanced for normal mode. Outside of that, I think it's safer to go on hard mode because of how stacked my party has become. We also kept our progress, so I should have Relnor learn some basic skills. Okay, OC mainframe. Where's the enemy? What? What was that? Some kind of puzzle? We did it! I don't know what I did, but it worked! 
We got past through the first firewall. That was so weird. We have to activate a few notes before this spiral comes down. Okay. What the? Were those humans? After all these years, we found it. It was protected by a cloaking field. Even now, our sensors detect nothing. Will it work? Preliminary results from the experiment seem to support the chief director's hypothesis. The ship is indeed connected to the air relics using an unknown carrier wave. Excellent. What? A ship? Could, uh, could it be the Dauntless? Or something else? Or maybe a Malarian ship? Excellent. Begin the ev evacuation immediately. Excavation immediately. Yes, Chief Director. It's just a flashback. It survived. What is it? A prototype vessel. A ship. Cromwell said it's connected to the air relics using an unknown carrier wave. In concert with the inhibitor, the supercarrier was built to stop the Advena. Who are these Advena anyway? Beings displaced from their natural time and place. Accessing coordinates. Coordinates acquired. 102.4, 142.1. Okay, next one. Their days are numbered. This time will be different. We'll stop this before it starts. Now that we possess the inhibitor, they'll be cut off from their lifeline. They'll never be able to take root. We must execute the chief director's plan to prevent the war. Our very existence is on the line. Wait, are they talking about the Calderans? That's what th those guys who destroyed Earth before? We must prevent the purge at all costs. Purge. We must stop this before it starts. What's she referring to? So that's what. So maybe that might be why you have the option to join them. Um, maybe just to be that desperate to avoid the purge. They are trying to avoid it in their own way. So you have to running a totalitarian government, huh? Weird. Okay, so I actually have to talk to the nodes directly instead of just viewing the flashback. I see. Okay, but I don't think these nodes are going to be unguarded. No deactivated? Never mind, I guess they are. No deactivated? Okay. OC mainframe. What is this? A map of the entire planet? We installed the inhibitor, but we're, we've been unable to activate the ship. It requires a malarian consciousness. Oh no, they're gonna... What if they steal the consciousness from cyberspace? That was supposed to be taken care of. I apologize, Chief Director. Our excavation team came under the attack of an ORC terrorist cell. We lost the android. Unacceptable. Shall we eliminate all known ORC elements from orbit? A few technical anti matter charges should make quick work of them. No, we need the android intact. Do this the old-fashioned way. A hostage, maybe? Maybe we'll take a ho hostage to try to exchange for the android. Burn every ORC solvent to the ground until you find the android. Leave no stone unturned. 
We cannot allow such a dangerous tool to remain in the hands of the Coalition. Understood, Chief Director. Malarian Consciousness. Lost Android. Are you referring to us? The prototype uses a neural interface. It was designed only for Malarian Consciousness. Are you saying that you'd be able to activate the ship? I believe so. However, I'm only of one mind. It would be difficult. Look! It appears the majority of our forces are preoccupied with guarding the ship. Oh no, is that the real one? No one can stand in our way. Activating Selenov Array. Initializing communications test. Communications test successful. Distance 942.7 light years. Latency 15 milliseconds. Where are you? My root physical form, my Mars Compound 13 Soul System. My mind everywhere all at once. Thanks to the array. So that's why he was able to show up in the freaking banking program all, so, all of a sudden. The future belongs to us now. Does he have like digital copies all over the world or something? Or are they? Uh, I'm not sure. This is all now array. So this array is how Kern was able to be everywhere at one, all at once. He's no longer limited to a single body. The deck is stacked. Even if we killed his physical body, he could just download his mind into a new one because there's, because he's just online now. He's like a virus. He's been touched by the Advena. Only inhibitor can stop this. How will it help, Zeron? It'll block the ice gaze. It'll stop their approach. The eye. The memory fragment. It is lost. I can't quite remember. Do we know the location of this array? Acquiring coordinates. This all novel array is in located in the Proxima star system, orbiting the moon of the third planet. Let's move on. Conference Chamber. You outdid yourself this time, Fraxton. It looks so warm and inviting. We made sure to get every detail just right. The representatives will believe the upcoming conference is genuine. Once we have them all in one place, we'll have a nice surprise waiting for them. Wait, what? The attack will be blamed on the coalition. The outer rim will be begging us to keep them warm and safe. A false flag operation again? The Coalition will never rise to be a serious force in the sector. The war will pre be prevented. The purge will be stopped. Countless lives will be saved. We'll be in control. This time, it will be different. This time? Wait, so does that mean that in a different timeline, the ORC already won somehow? The heck? How is any of this going to prevent the purge? Exactly. They're planning to attack their own conference, blaming the attack on the Outer Rim Coalition. They mention a war ha that hasn't occurred, yet they speak of it as if they've already seen it. What's going on here? They use time as a weapon. They, they stop those who will rise to challenge their power. Whether they realize it or not, they are agents of the Advena. We're, we were so close to stopping them. All was lost. Not all was lost. We have to find that ship. They won't be able to activate it without you. There's still a chance, no matter how small. Why are they doing all this? Insufficient information at the present time. We got what we came for. Let's get out of here. Jacking out. Oh, come on, Kern. Found you. You won't be getting away this time. I really do have to fight, Kern. The last Malarian. I need what you have. No! I'll never help you. I'm afraid you'll have no choice in the matter. I don't think I'm malfunction death overload. I don't think I'm supposed to win this. Yo, what is that? I am on normal mode. How am I? No, the mode difficult. The difficulty modes actually change your stats and not the enemies. I think. I think he's immune to it. I think he's immune to data locking. So yeah, I'm screwed. Damn. You're mine, Malarian. What secrets does the last Malarian hold? Let's see. Yes. I can feel it. Was there no way to avoid this? Zeron's being copied and decompiled. What was, was once yours? It's mine. No. Are you kidding me? That took away our only advantage. What, was I supposed to run from that battle? The Malarians, I see them so clearly now. Their memory lives on, for me. What? A data lock? Chronos 13, get us out of here! 
I can't hold him down for long. Crap. It decompiled, but do we still have the original Zeron on our side? That's a weird... Chris, are you okay? Do you find anything? Affirmative. What do you find? What's going on in the Virago Valley? They're ex exhibiting a powerful Malarian prototype vessel that survived their downfall. However, they've been unable to activate it. It can only be activated by, by a Malarian consciousness. And now they have their own Zeron, a uh, copy of Zeron. In other words, the Malarian that's stuck in your head, Zeron, he can activate the ship. Affirmative. Wow. We now have a serious chance to fight back. About that, do we know why they're doing all this? Why here? Why now? They were trying to prevent a war. Something they called a purge. They spoke of it as if they've already seen it. They said our rim collision was the cause. That's ridiculous. Our forces are nothing compared to theirs. We don't even have a unified fighting force. The pigs have spread our forces pretty out and pretty thin. Apparently that will not always be the case. They feared the rise of the our rim collision. They had the location of every ORC settlement on Infernus. Scratch brings us next on the list. It is in grave danger. They know the location of every ORC settlement. Why haven't they bombed them all? The cloaking field was supposed to keep us safe. They were looking for a lost android containing a malarian consciousness. They didn't want to damage it. In other words, you. They ordered their forces to use more conventional means to find the android. Bring every settlement to the ground. But th if they already copied Zeron, they don't need you anymore. They can just bomb everything without uh, any consequence now. Not good. That's what happened to Echo Base. All over the Zeron thing in this head, in your head. We ran into another problem, Kern. He found us. He copied and de decompiled Zeron's program, absorbing it into himself. He now has the knowledge of the Malarians and Zeron. That means he can activate the ship. This is a disaster. You handed the Malarian to him on a silver platter. How does this psychopath keep finding you? The array enables his mind to exist anywhere within the Alliance territory simultaneously. Although his physical body remains on Mars Compound 13's soul system. You encountered Kern in cyberspace. There he seemed almost un unstoppable. But Kern is not in the furnace. He's on Mars. We still have a chance. But we have to act fast. What? So we're, we have to go to Mars in order to assassinate this guy? If we can take out that array, Kern's consciousness will no longer be able to influence, infiltrate systems this far out. The lines of communication will be cut. Anomalous activity detected. Unauthorized access detected. Initiating security protocol. We've been discovered. Let's split. That's a lot of dudes. Level 9 threat detected. What the? Oh, that's a time effect. A speed effect. Yeah, it only costs 92 power when I have. Anyways, since it's scaling to my max, my max power to begin with. Well, that works. How are we gonna get out of here? Remotely activating one of the sand haulers. It should only be a few minutes. Won't we just get shot down by our air defenses? Not if we create a distraction. Press 13, use the mainframe terminal. Send out a signal on every ESA carrier wave at once. Bury them in their own communication signals. It'll create chaos. Affirmative. Enemy communications jammed. The jamming will only be temporary. Let's take this place out. For good. Setting your charges. Charge a set. Is there a, a time limit thing? There's no way we'll be able to leave for the front door. We have to get through to the roof. Let's go. We only have a few minutes before we're involuntarily cremated. Is there a time limit to worry about at all? What the heck is that? Okay. Yeah, there's enemies all over the floor now. Oh man, this is dangerous. Okay, but since we're not in cyberspace anymore... Man, I feel like there's no way to win that one, huh? They say he's unstoppable in cyberspace. So how strong are they if we fight them on very hard mode? Yeah, it might not be a good idea to have Jack do it since he doesn't ha he's not a technician. Technicians are OP when it comes to literally everything. Hey. 
missed. Yeah. Even on hard mode, we managed it. Better collect items while I can. Bathroom as well, huh? Oh wow, our reputation got even worse. <laughs> or better. Okay. So we have stairs that way. That's the front door, but I don't think we can go there. Yeah. Dude, that guy's still there! No, receptionist. Let's get him out of there, huh? Okay, so how are we supposed to get down from here? Or right should be here momentarily. That's our ship, right? The better be. Oh, nuts! That's a lot. Stop. Cromwell. That android is the property of the Alliance government. Return a unit, now! Screw you! How rude. You don't know all the trouble you've caused. And will cause. The death of us all. That will be your doing, unless you, you're stopped. Back off, bitch. This place is about to blow, sky high. I guess I'll have to take this into my own hands. What? How? An what the heck? Just go see and you realize. Really question the android and will spare your lives. Oh my goodness, that's actually a lot of damage. Okay, electric discharge, and also nanobot gel, holy moly. <laughs> nanobot spray? Okay, hard mode is not messing around, huh? Against a single target, I should use Scythe Boomerang. Scythe Boomerang. And Medical Triage on you. And done. Even on very hard mode, my, the equipment set I have is, was enough to win, but still, if the enemy had gotten another turn, I might have been wiped out. That was a really strong AoE on the enemy's part, on very hard. You have to get out of here now! It's still standing! This place is about to blow! If I can't have you, nobody can! Nobody can. Oh no! Dang it, how come you didn't get on the ship? What? Err. Well, a bunch of stuff. Electric, electronic gamma augmentation. Advena Zeron. How the heck did you fail to jump on there with everyone else? Chronos 13 is being scrambled. T17. User grab hook. Hurry. Acknowledged. Oh crap, is he gonna be, like, put up commission for the rest of the game? No. Wait, did, did she survive? Probably held her out the last second, huh? This will at least keep them from using that facility for their own stuff. Oh no. Neural? Wait. 
Zeron's still here. Sort of. Grim's routine continues to be unresponsive. That woman, Cromwell did this. My essence remains intact, but this place, it's so broken. Grim's routine, wake up. Don't tell me I'm stuck here forever. Well, you probably already were. You didn't have a body to go back to, unless you wanted another android. I'll create a bridge between myself and what remains. Oh no, is this a cyberspace level? Did it work? Unknown. Error. Neural network degradation 86%. Emergency backup route subroutine inaccessible. Chrono's routine doesn't sound too good. The unit's essence is shattered. I will do what I can. Self repair protocols offline. Ready to receive additional input. We will attempt to repair the damage to Gara. Come with us, Chrono's routine. Affirmative. Yeah, I'm. Ch Holy moly, we're, we got. Uh, uh, we, wow. Uh. Well, first off, I'm gonna be on normal mode. I don't think... I don't think this uh, uh, cyber mode was balanced for anything higher than normal. It's already pretty challenging on normal, considering how strong the actual beatable boss was. And oh, look at that reputation! It's just getting more extreme, more tilted to one side, huh? But why is the overall positive? Shouldn't the ESA reputation be uh, uh, loss be bigger than the reputation gained with the ORC? Yikes. This is getting really intense. I don't suppose they'll let me back to Mole Town either. Dang, just when we thought we were getting somewhere then. Well, at least we have one copy of Zeron, but the uh, the enemy has the error copy. But the thing is, will that will that copy of Zeron cooperate? That's a real question. Because Zeron seems to have his own will, maybe. I don't actually know. Yeah, if Zeron, if Zeron can just keep the enemy busy for a while, that would be great. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Starship Rebellion. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.